Good Tuesday morning, everybody. I'm Kirk Yonke. Hope you're doing well. It's bright and early. Hope you got your day off to a good start. Grab your uh, cup of coffee or whatever gets you going in the morning, and uh, we will help you get informed before you head out the door. want to give you a breakdown of some of the stories that we're following for you on ABC 15 Daybreak this morning. First of all, that tornado in Joplin, Missouri. Wow. Uh, the pictures and stories just continue to roll in. We're going to be following it throughout the morning. The death toll on that tornado is now over 100. In fact, it's tied for the death toll of the sing single most deadliest tornado ever, which happened in Flint, Michigan back in the 1950s. The sad thing is there are still people missing, and the, the search for survivors continues there. So that death toll, unfortunately, most likely will go up. Uh, we're going to be talking live with a reporter out there in Joplin, and we'll be following the updates throughout the morning on that. Also, uh, Brian McElhatton on his way right now to a potential house fire that we're hearing about in Scottsdale. So uh, we're going to check in with him when he gets there and bring you the latest as we learn more about what exactly is going on. Uh, we, we did hear that people were living in this house. As far as we know, we're not sure exactly how bad this fire is at this point. Uh, stay tuned for updates on that. Also, Toyota thinks that you need to have a social network for your car. You know, we've got Facebook, we've got Twitter, and now they are introducing a new social network that would interact with your car. We'll break down why they think this would help you as a driver. And uh, T-Mobile, for all you T-Mobile users out there, upgrades have been made to the T-Mobile network here in Phoenix that could have a big impact on your internet usage on your mobile phone. We'll tell you what they've done and how much of a difference they say it may make. Okay, some of the stories... Not all the stories. You're going to have to watch Daybreak for all of that. We'll be following breaking news throughout the morning. We start at 4.30, and we're on until 7. We hope to see you. If not, we're always on at abc15.com. Have a great Tuesday.